Keith Appling may never play professional basketball again. The former Michigan State basketball player is back in jail, and yes, it's another case involving a gun. 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig joins us live with both sides of his latest arrest. Kim, is Appling still locked up right now? Yes, Carolyn. Keith Appling remains in jail. He remained in jail all day today. He was actually arrested last night. And one of the many questions now is could this third arrest have a judge revoking his bond or setting it even higher? It's my understanding that the police officer stopped him as a result of the fact that he was supposed to have had tenant windows. Keith Appling arrested again. It began around 9:10 last night, and Detroit police say they did not stop him near Russell on East 7 Mile for the tinted windows, but rather because they spotted Appling's 2013 Dodge Challenger making a turn without using his signal. When the officers approached the vehicle, they did observe a strong smell of what appeared to be marijuana inside the vehicle. We're told when Appling was handing his identification to one of the tactical response officers, he suddenly put the window up and drove off. Officers pursued him and stopped him about a half a mile later near Appling's house on Detroit's east side, and a Gucci bag they noticed on the passenger side was now gone, a bag containing a gun they think he tossed out of the window during that short chase. Officers went back to the location, uh, tracked the route, found the bag, it did contain a weapon along with some uh, paperwork that did identify the driver as Mr. Appling. Uh, and so he did have some personal belongings in there as well. Well, I don't know all of the facts, but I hope that they would have a video. And if they have a video, we should see an object coming out of the motor vehicle. But I don't believe that they have a video that would support that contention. Keith Appling's arrest makes it his third since May, another case they could have him charged with fleeing and yet a third charge of carrying a concealed weapon. But his attorneys suggest the officers are targeting him. There's one prior case involving the identical police officers who stopped Keith uh, yesterday. And uh, that's raised our suspicion as to what the purpose of them uh, coming after Mr. Appling uh, is at this point. So we're definitely concerned about that and we're going to be looking into that. And we asked why did their client drive off after police stopped him the first time last night. He moved the vehicle to get to, to a better lit area. And we could know more tomorrow on what, if any, new charges will be filed against Keith Appling. We will certainly keep you updated. Reporting live in Detroit, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Back to you. All right, Kim, thanks so much. And